Despite the fact that liver and gallbladder congestion is one of the most common health problems these days, conventional medicine seems to neglect it. You or someone you know might have been asked to remove the gallbladder when stones had formed, but it turns out that it need not to be so. While the gallbladder is quite a small organ, it takes part in many significant functions which help us digest food properly. Situated under the liver, the gallbladder is a real powerhouse in breaking up the ingested fats. Its major function is to store bile utilized for digestion, which is produced by the liver. If bile is not being utilized for digestion, it gets stored in the gallbladder for later use. When we eat, food travels down the digestive system into the small intestine, which sends message to the gallbladder to release bile to break the food down. How are gallstones formed in the gallbladder? Stones can form in gallbladder, or the liver if things too bad, such as too many bile salts too much cholesterol, and other calcifications. These tiny stones are a result of crystallized bile in the gallbladder, when there is more cholesterol present than the bile is able to dissolve. Other factors that contribute to the formation of gallstones include obesity, a high-fat diet, and taking hormone pills like birth control. Gallstones typically go unnoticed for a long time or until they get big enough to induce symptoms. If you experience sudden pain in the abdomen followed by vomiting and nausea, or sudden back pain between the shoulders, it is very likely that you have a gallstone problem. If the skin starts turning yellow, see a doctor right away, because this means that your bile duct is congested, and bile is unable to reach the small intestines. Here are some of the most common signs of gallstones. Although subtle, they are quite accurate signs indicating that you need to take measures to solve this problem. Bad breath and frequent burping. Dark spots or patches on the lips. Cataracts. Swollen, sensitive or bleeding gums. A yellow in color of the teeth, tooth decay. Green or dark color on the temple area at the sides of the forehead. Oily skin in the area of the forehead. Hardening and thickening at the tip of the nose. Water eye bags under the lower eyelids. Brown or black patches of spots on either sides of the forehead, on the back between the shoulder blades, and on the back of hands and forearms. How to do a gallbladder stones cleanse. Prior jumping into doing a gallbladder cleanse, it is important to do a gastrointestinal cleanse to clean out the bowels. There are various ways to flush out gallstones, but not all of them are safe. Needless to say, the safest products to use are the natural ones. Gallbladder Cleanse Protocol A cleanse typically takes about 6 to 7 days. If you are not sure about it, consult a natural healer or naturopath to give you tips on how to do the entire process properly. What you will need to do a gallbladder flush 1 half cup of cold pressed virgin olive oil 1 liter of fresh green apple juice for each day of the process 4 tablespoon of Epsom salt dissolved in 3 8 ounces glasses of water 6 ounces of grapefruit juice or fresh lemon and orange juice combined The week prior to cleanse day The malic acid in apple juice offers cleansing properties, which soften the gallbladder stones, and prepare them for elimination. Drink at least a liter of fresh apple juice for 6 days before the cleanse day. Keep your diet no dairy and low fat during the preparation days. Eat more fresh fruits and veggies along with small amounts of meat. Avoid chilled foods or drinks since they reduce the efficiency of the cleanse. On actual day of the gallbladder cleanse. Drink 32 ounces of apple juice in the morning. Have a small and light breakfast, such as cooked oatmeal, fruits with kefir or yogurt, or steamed veggies with unrefined salt. Avoid animal protein, dairy products and fat. Mix 4 tablespoons of Epsom salt and 24 ounces of water in a jar, and divide them into 4 6-ounce servings. 6 p.m. Have a 6 ounces serving of this mixture. 8 p.m. Drink the second serving of the 6 ounces Epsom salt. 9.45 p.m. Mix the grapefruit juice, or lemon and oranges juice, and the olive oil in a jar. Close the jar and shake until the solution is fully combined. 10 p.m. Drink the juice-olive oil mixture without stopping. Feel free to use a straw if it's easier for you. Leave the glass on your bedside table and lie down immediately with an extra pillow. Stay still for at least 20 minutes. Next morning, 
Day 2 of the Cleanse 6.30 am, drink the third 6 ounce serving of the Epsom salt. 8.30 am, drink the last serving of the Epsom salt followed by fresh juices of choice. You can have a light breakfast, such as fruits. What to look out for? The stones come in different safes of green, from light colored to darker green ones, depending on their age. Some people may remove many tiny, white cholesterol crystals which could turn into more serious problem, if not eliminated. Repeated Gallbladder Cleanse This cleanse should be repeated every month or until there are little or no stones being eliminated. For some people it takes three months, for some five, and for some up to a year. On the second cleanse the gallbladder will release more stones, up to 100 to 200 stones, 